everybody and welcome back to my channel and today we're going to be talking about the strategy for the rights of persons with disability the union of equality european commission presents strategy for the rights of persons with disabilities today the european commission presents an ambitious strategy for the rights of persons with disabilities 2021 to 2030 to ensure full participation in society on an equal basis with others in the eu and beyond in line with the treaty as on the functioning of the European Union and Charter of Fundamental Rights that the European Union establishes equality and non-discrimination as a cornerstone of EU policy. Persons with disabilities have the right to take part in all areas of life, just like everybody else. So that's their introduction to what they're saying on this policy. So what is the aim of this strategy? The strategy for the rights of persons with disabilities 2021 to 2030 intends to tackle the diverse challenges persons with disability face, it aims to progress on all areas of the United Nations Convention on the Rights of Persons with Disabilities. Both at the EU and member state level, the goal is to ensure that persons with disabilities in Europe, regardless of their sex, age, racial or ethnic origin, religion or belief, age or sexual orientation, enjoy human rights, have equal opportunities, equal opportunities to participate in society, to be able to decide whom whom they live or who they live with, when be able to move freely in the regardless of their support needs, no longer experience discrimination. So what are my thoughts as an autistic woman who identifies as being disabled? I think that this news from the EU European Commission has finally taken the needs of persons with disabilities seriously. I agree with them that strongly that disabled persons with disabilities should be included to participate in everyday life like everybody else. I feel people do not realise that people with disabilities are often violated and isolated because people do not know how to communicate with us or to give us successful ways of communicating with the outside world. I feel that we're often on the front line of being made fun of. So I'm going to get my notes out for the second bit. I hope that the UK can join on to this EU strategy to help better support the needs of people with disabilities. As an autistic woman, I'm very happy that the European Parliament are doing this for the next 10 years. The European Disability Strategy 2010 to 2020 powered the way to a barrier to free Europe from the life of approximately 87 million persons living in the EU with some form of disability. Accessibility, access to build and virtual environments and information goods and services. So yeah, that's kind of what they're aiming to do. And um, what I will do is I will attach more information down about it down below in my video description. But this is something I am really proud of because it's something finally that the EU is actually doing to help the many, many millions of people in the EU with a disability, whether that's physical, mental, emotional, neurodevelopmental. I feel this is a good thing that should have been done way before now. But I guess, again, it's about politics and the way to include people with disabilities. I don't know how many people they have involved with people with disabilities on this project. But I hope as it's a 10 year strategy, it's going to be very much involving people's rights, people's family, carers, professionals. And I very much look forward to seeing the future updates. I will link the previous strategy down below as well in the video description. But I thought I'd just talk about my experiences, how I've been treated as a disabled person. And UK is very much far behind with regards to EU on this kind of thing. I feel the EU has really got people involved and is listening. And is trying to help so people have a fulfilled life and that the problem is it's about communication it's about how to help people succeed who have disabilities and i feel this policy is going to help a lot of people and i'm just very pleased that this is actually happening as part of the eu commission so please like comment share and subscribe and i will be back with you next time bye